What's up, LEGO fans? I am DL Studios, and I'm back with another video. This time, we're gonna do a mock. But, um, uh, the, uh, month of December has come, and, uh, I thought, what a better way to celebrate December than do three Christmas-themed videos for you guys. For you guys. Okay, so, uh, I thought... Uh, today we're gonna do a mock, so this would be week one. Week two would be another mock, and then the last week will be a very special Christmas set. Lego set. And, uh, yeah. Let's get into this. So, what goes on top of every Christmas tree? A star. <laughs> this is my, my mock. We are gonna build a tree topper. I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. Um, and it's quite simple. It took me, it didn't take me too long to put it together. And uh, yeah, and it works. Uh, it works on my tree. I tried it, that's what the thumbnail picture will be. But yes, um, it fits. And uh, depending on the size of your tree, it may be different. Um, but yes, I'm gonna show you guys how to build it. So, the first thing, this actually comes apart. Tell me if this is an illegal technique, if you put that blue piece in that hole. Is that is that illegal or not? I don't know. But, we're going to start with this. This is probably the most complex part. Um, so, let me take it apart really quick. Okay, so here are your uh, sections uh, all lined up and taken apart. Your first thing you're going to want to do is build a... Uh, this... <laughs> Not sure what to call this, but it's just a bunch of these hinged pieces. They fold like that, you can see. And you want to stick them on kind of like a little bit of an incline. You can see that. Just a little on an incline. And then you're going to fold it in and connect these two studs together. Uh, not that way, this way. And it should make a little square. And this is actually what should hold your tree, or hit hold in the tree. Um, and I tried this when I built it, so you might want to adjust the size, but yeah. Um, next, um, you're gonna need these. You use a, another hinge piece, but these are, these click. They're a little more restrictive, so they can only move certain spots. Um, and I put these slopes on just to give it some clean look. I used a lighter yellow, so we're going to put those on there, and we're going to do the same thing here, just put a red, uh, this red piece on the back, and it'll be like a pattern. And these are all the same, and they all go the same way, like that. Now you're going to fold these all in, one, the top section, oh, that broke, hold on. Okay, so now you should have something that looks like this. Um, and it may be a little bit different in size, like I said. Um, next, you're gonna take a yellow plate. This is just a two by two yellow plate. And I put a bunch of clips on it to attach to this bar. So, let's put that on. This is, you might wanna be a little delicate here because uh, this could this is what holds it together, there we go. Just like that, and it'll have a little bit of movement, make it as uh, straight as possible. Then you're gonna grab one of these Technic pieces, stick that on there, and then the top, or not the top, that's the top, but this section I used um, some slopes, I used one of these pieces with piece in here, and then I grab this, which is just uh, one of these, with a white thing on the top with one of these. And then I stuck this in between and pushed that in so it holds it upright and it won't move. And then this is optional, you don't need it, I just put it for looks. And then there's a hole there, and you stick that right there. And it'll swivel a little bit. Um, but yeah, the star, you can really just look at the bricks there, um, but I can show in chunks once again. 
you can see it's very quite simple so we've got um, you're probably gonna want to start with these two uh, bottom pieces here it's just a total of eight uh, two by four bricks and then you're gonna grab one of these which is a uh, let me see here is that a, yeah an eight by two and I sometimes you won't have the right size like I can see I got a two by four there and so it really doesn't matter and then this section you guys can take a look at that get a screenshot of that the size it should be and then you stick that on like right there and then the top right there and you know you can build whatever shape you want I just built this because a star is pretty iconic so yes and then you stick it in here and I don't know if that's an illegal technique but if it is somebody tell me because <laughs> that's how I designed it and uh, well I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> But yeah, I hope you guys like that mock. That's pretty much it. And uh, it will swivel a little bit. You can customize this too. It's a little a little top heavy there, but when you're setting it on a tree, it shouldn't move. Mine moved. I set it, I had it out on our tree for like 24 hours and it it didn't move. It didn't fall at all. So that was really nice. But yeah. Uh, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button if you'd like, and uh, yeah, this is the first of three Christmas themed videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time with more Christmas videos.